Good evening and welcome to uh, this week's Saturday evening cocktail. We're actually doing two today. Um, today's, of course, uh, traditionally Kentucky Derby Day, so I'm getting these in a little bit earlier in case you want to watch this and have a drink to watch the virtual race that's happening. Uh, I, I think it's going to go um, Secretariat, um, Affirm, Seattle Slough. Um, but that's how I think it'll go. Anyway, Kentucky Derby, nothing's more traditional than a mint julep, and that's what we're going to do today. So first things first, we're going to start with the mint, and I've got a whole bunch of mint leaves here that I want to muddle together, so I'm going to kind of rub them together a little bit. I'm going to throw them in this cup here. I've got about a three-quarter ounce of water that I'm going to put in, and I'm going to take some regular old white sugar and a couple of uh, decent bar spoons full. So we're gonna start muddling all this together in here. I'm using the clear cup so you can see. And the bourbon we're gonna use, we're gonna go very traditional. I have Woodford Reserve. In fact, I've got the Woodford Reserve um, from last year's Kentucky Derby edition. Um, they put one out every year for the race. Um, and we are going to use a really good strong measure And a little more. And all this good stuff, we're just gonna muddle together for a bit. And you can see, get all these flavors kind of mixed up together. And we are going to gently strain into a, I don't really have a strainer, we're just gonna pour into a glass with a lot of crushed ice and another big garnish of mint. Now, if we're being real traditional about this, you've got the giant mint that you really get in, you know, in your face when you're, when you're drinking it. And, um, you know, we would want one of those little straws with the spoon attached, which I don't have, but mint julep, very traditional. Cheers. Now, I'll be honest, I'll make a confession. I don't really particularly care for a mint julep. Um, to me, I think it takes away from the, from the spirit a little bit. So another nice cocktail you can have for Kentucky Derby Day is a Gold Rush, which I will prepare in case you want something different. And this one, I've got a shaker full of ice and I'm going to use Blanton's, um, single barrel for this. And again, we'll use a, um, respectable measure of this. And pour that right in there. And pretty simple drink here. Um, I have a honey syrup, which is basically equal parts honey and water heated until uh, heated until combined. Regular honey is is too thick uh, to pour into a drink like this. And lastly, we're gonna do about a measure of grapefruit juice. Uh, And again, all this is going to get shaken pretty aggressively here. And I've got another glass, which we will strain that into. Got a great color. And again, it's almost like a, you know, think of it as like a bourbon sour. Um, with honey being the syrup, I've got a little twist of lemon to get right going over there. Drop that in. Cheers, Gold Rush. That's good. And lastly, I just want to show this off. Um, if you just want to drink um, for the Derby, I always have a blood oath to toast the horses. Anybody, everybody be safe, be well, don't drink and drive and all that. Cheers.